Brothers and sisters of the celestial energies, brother Winston, what's going on, guys? Taking a stroll down the road. Um, there's a lot of activity that's going on right now in uh, our galaxy and our universe. Our galactic sun is literally sending off massive waves of energy, and these energies are very powerful energies that um, that um, they are noticing. Um, I was just watching a video um, about the magnetosphere. They're saying the magnetosphere is getting pounded. Oh, excuse me. Magnetosphere is getting pounded by uh, solar waves. Now, these inorganic beings, what they're saying is, they're saying um, the solar activity was unexpected. And you got to understand, 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 overstand why they say the solar activity is unexpected. They say it's unexpected because um, they are forecasting or projecting when the sun, our galactic sun, is going to give off a, <laughs> a blast. I mean, that's how dumb they are. That's that, and we we dealing with some dummies who try to tell us what the weather's going to be because they're going to try because they they're going they're attempting to make the weather the way they want it to be. All right, that's why it's time for us to wake up, brothers and sisters. All right, get about that sleep. Um, so. The solar wind is literally banging the planet. According to them, they say it's, it's banging the planet, but our planet is actually drawing that solar wind. And you got to remember, you know, we got this great celestial event coming with all this powerful, powerful dark energy that's flowing everywhere. I mean, and 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 it is a beautiful thing. Oh, we got. Um, we're coming to the end of this uh, galactic convergence, which in two days, this galactic convergence will be uh, ending and we'll be moving into the planetary convergence, like the energy that goes from, from one area to another area. And we saw the universal convergence and the energy that was going off the universal convergence. And I hope you guys have been watching what they call the space weather and checking out the galactic convergence where all the galaxies have been uh, uh, literally um, hyperactive. All right, each galaxy has got its own sun. All right, this is the Omega Galaxy. We got our own sun. You have the Andromeda Galaxy. They have their own sun. You have the Isis Galaxy. They have their own sun. There's not one sun that lights up the universe. Each galaxy has got their own sun. All right, that's how it works. So in this planetary convergence, we're talking about all the planets unifying as one energy, as one body. And this planetary convergence will be um, uh, unifying all the realms as one realm. So it'll be 180 days for this universal convergence, which means that the portals and the gateways to the realms will be open. And we're going to be seeing a lot of shit. All right. So expect for this war thing to come down. All right. Expect for this war thing to come down. Expect for this thing to 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 go into hyper mode. And I need you guys to be very, very watchful of what's going on around you. OK, be very watchful. So we got a lot um, to focus on, a lot to soak in and a lot to do. All right. I'm just passing this on to y'all because y'all got to understand, understand, overstand what is taking place at this present moment. And we got a lot of stuff that's going on. OK, hold on for a minute, guys. All right, brothers, sisters, I'm back. So we're looking at some very powerful energies that's going to be coming up. Um, this system, these these inorganic beings are talking about. They're saying that the report that I saw that they're trying to forecast this solar energy is they saying that the sun will be casting out powerful energies from June 30th to July 4th. This is what they're forecasting. OK, remember, they are completely in the dark. This is the year of the phantom energy. It's going to get worse and worse as this entire calendar year um, moves on. Remember, we have paired up the energy with their time scam. They created this time scam. They created these calendars. 
They created all this stuff for their control. And now we are taking control of this. All right. I am Seema Bathuri Anu. All right. Very powerful dark angel from the planet Septeramin. All right. Planet. This is right behind our galactic sun, Septeramin. Understand, understand, overstand, brothers and sisters, that there are some powerful energies coming. This planetary convergence is is a very powerful uh, uh, event that's getting ready to take place. We must understand, understand, overstand that we are moving into a whole nother cycle of energy, a very powerful cycle of energy, and we are getting ready to flourish. This is why um, it's, it's been it was so important to get you guys fashioned with building and creating structures, opening up your mind, opening up the gateways within yourself. This is this is so important for you all to understand, to overstand, as well as to understand. All right, because this is what's going to take you into the next level of intelligence. All right. None of the information that these inorganic beings kept away from you has been removed from you. It's all within you. It's just a certain energy that must be exerted on the planet that will um, bring that, that, that memory back. Everything is within you. Nothing has been removed. They cannot, they, even though they have took the, their, their time, their time scam to miseducate everyone, all right? Because as when I came back to this planet here, believe me, I was miseducated as well. So even though they took their time to miseducate everyone, who is indigenous, original to this realm, to this planet, to this energy, they cannot remove that which is which belongs to you from you. And it was it is highly, highly impossible. All of this is still within you. All of the ancient knowledge, all of the ancient energies, all the of 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 the uh, ancient technology, ancient te intelligence, all of that is still within you. All right. And as this planetary convergence happens, it's going to start to awaken a lot of dormant knowledge, a dormant, a lot of dormant intelligence. All right. You working toward bringing yourselves into balance. Okay. Your meditation. All this plays a definite role in your ultimate return, my brothers and sisters. Understand, understand, overstand that our enemies are working day in, day out. They're working endlessly to fight against us. This is a never ending fight on their part. And they are working, uh, uh, it's like, it's like, it's pretty much like a conglomerate. They're working all together. They even got our own, all right? They even have our own brothers and sisters working hard against us, all right? They have our own who have vowed to work against their own kinfolk. They will be dealt with. That's, that's, that's just fine. They will be dealt with. But just know, brothers and sisters, all right, this planetary convergence is coming. There's gonna be things that I, to be honest with you, I I, I would never, I won't be able to explain it. I, I I won't be able to try to try to tell you guys what, what's 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 going to take what's going to take place. All right, I just want you all to see it for yourself. All right, just want you all to see this for yourself. What's going to take place? Because like I said, I don't want, I don't want nobody to say, oh, now he's trying to. Being a prophet and being a, and prophesying, you know that biblical shit. You know, because you got brothers, sisters who don't understand 
what's taking place. All right. You got brothers and sisters who don't understand what's taking place and they would rather live the lie. All right. They would rather live the lie instead of being in the realm of truth to know what is happening right before their eyes. All right. So it is highly important that you all understand, understand, overstand. We're coming to a point of absolute power. All of those, you know, we talked about the, the machinery that we had once and, and, and how those the, everything floated on the on, on the ground over the over the surface of the ground. You know, you all are searching. You're searching how to open, how to create these gateways. You're searching. Your heart is looking for this because you said this is a part of us. And you have these beings who literally took it upon themselves to try to hide this from you because they want it to be an absolute power. But their power is diminishing. They've been commanded to shut down certain programs and certain things, and it's moving fast. And they know what the fuck is going on because they're scared of those who are higher, the real higher beings. Because these beings here on our on our realm, they are not higher beings. There is nothing higher about them. There is nothing powerful about them. They have no power. They have no power whatsoever. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, you know, I pass this on to you because you got to understand your heart has been searching for this. And guess what? You will get your heart's desire. You will get your heart's desire and you will understand how to build those portals, how to create those vessels that uh, that can float over the ground and under the, over the water. All right. I was just outside um, when I got home from that. Um, um, jury duty thing I was uh, talking to my wife and I saw this long white tubular shaped structure going across the sky and I told my wife I said that's not a plane it was white and it was tubular and I said that's not a plane and she was looking and she couldn't see it right and I said babe whatever that is that's not a plane and I'm looking at it and I'm seeing it go across the sky, then all of a sudden it just disappeared. Just like that, it just disappeared. Or either either it, it disappeared or it just went at, at, it started uh, moving at a speed so high that it looked like it disappeared and it just went into warp mode. So you have to understand that a lot of that these gateways are getting ready to open up. And this planetary convergence is literally going to cause all the realms to mend together. And the mending of the realms together, these are the gateways, and this is the powerful energy, the powerful force that we've been waiting on for a long, long time, brothers and sisters. We've been waiting on this shit for a long time. So we've had to understand, understand, overstand that what's getting ready to come, you would never imagine. All right. There are creatures that these inorganic beings have never seen before that are um that are roaming this realm and they know that this is their end because they have the scrolls the scrolls talk about the stranger things the scrolls talk about the strange things alright so I just pass this on to you brothers and sisters you understand, understand, overstand everything that is going on and for those who don't want to see this let them remain asleep let the sleepers sleep because very soon they will awaken and when they awaken they will be glad not to be asleep again they're not going to be feel they're not going to feel bad for for being asleep they're just going to be glad i'm glad i'm so glad i'm not asleep i'm glad i'm i'm awakened so i can witness this because you know like we said we're going to we're going to get into the time to the day to the day and time when we're going to enter the realm of immortality the realm of invincibility all right and we're going to rebuild our realm the way it's supposed to be rebuilt and remember brother, brothers and sisters the war that's coming up we're going to have a shitload of help all right we're not going to be on our own we're going to have a shitload of help we got a lot of help 
All right, <laughs> we got a shitload of help. And these inorganic beings, these so these so-called white people, these they're they're the needs. N e d e s is what they are. The needs. They are scared. This is why they're building up their artillery. This is why they took funds from education and other places and built up their artillery. I heard that 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 there was a uh, um something going on with the Air Force. I heard something about an Air Force shortage, or maybe it was an airline shortage. It was an airline shortage. I heard. But I know that military um, is not getting certain funds. I think they're taking money from the military, trying to put it into space, into the space program, so that they can get out, get off, try to get off this planet. I, I truly feel that deep in my soul because you got a lot of military people who are not getting paid. All right, I mean, you got some who are getting paid, but um, truly deep in my soul. I feel like they're um, taking a lot of the funds from the military and put it into the space program. Because the space program is completely different. And that, you know, that uh, um, space, the space, uh, what is that? The, uh, you got the Army, Navy, the, the Marines, so you got the space uh, corp or whatever that is. You know, that was, that was started up by uh, Kennedy. That was another program that was started up by Kennedy. Um, and they finally got the the whole thing together. They had, you know, they had to take everything through Congress, had to go through the Queen, had to go through the Pope, had to go, you know, it's, it's all united. So you united there, like we say, it's their uh, conglomerate. So they had to get the Space Force. It's the Space Force. It's now the Space Force is is um, is up and running, but we haven't heard anything else. But what we do know is... Um, some of the monies was taken, you know, like I say, I feel deep within my soul that there were monies that was taken away from the, the, the basic military and put into the space program. All right. Because they're scared and they know what's coming. So this planetary convergence that's getting ready to take this, that's getting ready to come, uh, come up, uh, brothers and sisters, we're going to really see a lot, excuse me, a lot of changes here on the planet and on this realm. Like we say, all the planets will be unified as one energy and they will unify all the realms as one realm and all of the gateways will be open. You guys will see. You don't have to take my word for it. This will be for 180 days. And after the 180 days, a lot of a lot, a lot of shit will remain the same. Let's just say that, you know, energy doesn't change. Energy can't be destroyed. Energy can be created though white man say energy can be created or destroyed energy can be created it can be destroyed but mostly energy is transferred it's transferred and it's transformed all right so check you guys later <laughs> i think that's about enough we're gonna talk a little later you know the deal all power to the multi chakra celestial angelic beings when chaos reigns through forever and ever and ever. And remember, chaos brings change. Peace ain't never brought none to us. Much power to you all.